Now, for this word problem, I need to call Matthew's cousin, Giganta, to join us. Come on, Giganta. Here he is. Come on, you can go on my shoulder here. Let's read. Matthew picked a big bucket full of blueberries. And Giganta picked a small bucket full of blueberries. Okay, yeah, because he's smaller. Then they both ate three-fourths of their blueberries. Did they eat the same amount? What do you think? He has a small bucket full. He has a big bucket full. And they eat three-fourths. They did not eat the same amount, right? Who ate more? Aha, uh -huh, yeah, Matthew ate more. We can see it if we draw a picture. Let's draw a picture of two bucketfuls. Okay, if there's a big bucketful and then a small bucketful. And if it was divided into four parts. Okay, and you eat up to that, not to that much. Oh, maybe, let's color it in. Yeah, blueberries. Then this is more than that, right? Oh, he wants to go eat. Sure, go ahead. Eat your bucket full. Yum, 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 yum. Tastes good. All right, you want to join us for the rest? Let's see. Here is a challenge of comparing fractions. Lots of fractions to compare. You can even pause the video at this point and try to solve these on your own, okay? So, which one is more? Five-fifths or one-fifth? These are the same kinds of pieces. So five pieces is more than one piece. Eight ninths and four fourths. Don't get fooled and think that, oh, eight is a bigger number than four. Or nine is a bigger number than four. Four fourths is actually equal to one, one whole pi, right? Eight ninths is not. It is less than one pi. So that's how it goes. Eight ninths is less. Eight tenths and eight ninths. Notice there's eight and eight, the same number. The top numbers are the same. So there's the same amount of pieces. You have eight pieces and eight pieces. But are tenths smaller pieces or ninths? You know? Tenths are smaller pieces. So eight tenths is less than eight ninths. One fifth and one half, that's easy, right? A fifth is a much smaller piece than one half. Six ninths, seven ninths. That's easy again. Ninths and ninths, the same kinds of pieces. Seven pieces is more than six. Two halves and nine ninths. Don't get fooled. Nine ninths is the same as one whole pie. Now two halves is also one whole pie. These are equal. Five sevenths and one half. Imagine if you have something divided into seven pieces and you take five pieces. That's more than one half, isn't it? I hope you can see that. One half and two fourths. Ah, Giganta knows the answer. Correct! These are equal. Yes. And then lastly, one third and six tenths. Might be a little trickier. Think this way. Is this more than one half? No, it's less. How about this one? Is this more than one half? Yes, it is, because five tenths would be one half. So six tenths is a little bit more than one half. And this was less than one half. So one third is less than six tenths. All right, good job. We're all done with this lesson.